Hi everybody. Now, if you're not aware, April is Parkinson's Awareness Month and my name is Sharon Vesh and I'm a young onset Parkinson's patient. Now, I try to stay motivational, inspirational, and positive while living with Parkinson's. I love working out, being a Parkinson's advocate, and one of my favorite pastimes is painting. Now, as an artist with Parkinson's, I want to show others that you can overcome challenges and adversity through determination and perseverance. And this is why I love sharing my artwork with the world. Now, if you're not aware, Parkinson's usually affects people over the age of 60, but it can affect people under the age of 60 as well, such as myself. And it's considered a boutique disease, meaning that it affects everybody differently. But one thing in common in all Parkinson's patients, unfortunately, is that the disease is progressive and degenerative. Parkinson's affects certain nerve cells in the brain and gradually breaks them down or causes cells to die. Many of the symptoms are due to the loss of neurons that produce a chemical messenger in your brain called dopamine. When dopamine levels decrease, it causes abnormal brain activity leading to impaired movement and other symptoms of Parkinson's. And the cause of Parkinson's disease at this time is still really unknown. Parkinson's is not an easy disease to live with and most people don't understand the symptoms and it's constant change from minute to minute or from day to day. Most people think of Parkinson's as a slow moving old person's disease with shaking syndrome, but it's actually much more complicated than this. It affects both motor and non-motor symptoms and over 60,000 Americans are diagnosed every year and over 10 million people worldwide are now living with Parkinson's. Scientists are working harder than ever to find a cure and to find better treatments for Parkinson's disease. Scientists actually have discovered clumps of a specific substance within the brain cells of Parkinson's patients called Lewy bodies, which researchers believe these Lewy bodies hold an important clue to the cause of Parkinson's. Although many substances are found in Lewy bodies, scientists believe an important one is the natural and widespread protein called alpha-synuclein. It's found in Lewy bodies in a clumped form, which usually destroys healthy brain cells and it causes them to die, which is what science believes. And I'm actually excited to share that I'm involved in a long-term clinical research study receiving an investigational drug that hopefully breaks down these clumps before cellular destruction happens and before it destroys my healthy neurons. So for the month of April, I want to support the continued progress of Parkinson's research by donating a portion of the sales on my Etsy account, Art by Sharon and Jim to Team Fox Detroit, which is a grassroots community for the Michael J. Fox Foundation for Parkinson's Research, and I'm also a board member. Any purchases made through the month of April on my Etsy account, I will donate 10% of all proceeds to Parkinson's Research, except for one very special collection called my Hope Collection. Any purchases done from this collection will be a 15% donation. The Hope Collection is a very emotional collection. The art painting that was created for this special collection was created by me when I was actually first diagnosed with Parkinson's. It's called Hope. The light and love of hope grows everywhere because hope holds the power in all of us to see the light in the darkness. And my painting of a hope showcases hope in many forms from the trees within the gray background. It shows the darkness yet the trees start to bloom and they come back to life. The tulip is a flower of Parkinson's and I chose to place it in the center of the forest using the color orange, which represents energy, enthusiasm, and the fascination for a cure. And having the tulip in the middle of the pathway shows the power to overcome obstacles that life faces us with. And the butterfly represents the strength to take flight in any situation in life. And the lady in red, well, she sits with a smile on her face as she realizes how strong hope survives. This collection can be found on my Etsy account under the section, Hope Parkinson's Awareness. You'll find it available in a t-shirt for purchase, a coffee mug, a face mask, a wall painting, as well as a painting print. As I stated, 15% of the purchases for the Hope Collection will go towards research and all of the other purchases on my Etsy account, I will donate 10% throughout the month of April. I'll leave my link below for you to check out the items and I hope you do make a purchase. They say knowledge holds the key to understanding and understanding leads to research and research leads to better treatments and ultimately a cure. Thank you for watching and now go buy something off my Etsy account to help support Parkinson's research.